Hey guys, it's Brittany, and today I have a lot going on in my background. I'm actually filming in my closet because the light everywhere else in my house is just kind of crazy today. It's one of those iffy, kind of want to rain, kind of doesn't, overcast kind of days. And I figured it'd be a great opportunity to film you guys a video. So I'm going to do another review video today, probably really quick. I'm going to be reviewing the... Batiste Dry Shampoo in the scent Floral and Flirty Blush. Um, I got this at TJ Maxx for $5.99. I've seen it a lot on some other YouTube videos and I figured that I'd give it a try. Um, first time I've ever used dry shampoo. It's the only kind that I've ever used. Um, and I was kind of worried that it would kind of make my hair look goofy, but I haven't had any problems with it. And the smell is great. I love the smell. Um, a lot of people did have some complaints about the smell of this, but I haven't noticed anything. I think it smells really good. Um, so, to use it, it says shake vigorously. We'll shake it. Go ahead and try. Um... And then you're going to spray it to your roots. And I'll let you guys see that it doesn't do anything weird to your hair. Um, I don't know if you can see that. There's no, like, powdery residue. There's no... I mean, it looks alright. It looks like... looks like hair. And then you're just going to massage it in. Um, and you'll style as you normally would. The smell, it does kind of linger. Um, it does kind of stay around, but like I said, it's a really good smell. It's not unpleasant. My husband doesn't seem to have any issue with the smell of the product. Alright, so as you can see, I mean, it hasn't done anything weird to my hair. It looks perfectly fine. It's not like powdery or anything. I know that some dry shampoos tend to be powdery, um, but this one's not. Anyway, after massaging through with your fingertips, you can brush style and go, I'm actually not going anywhere. Still in my pajamas. Lazy day. Um, but yeah, I give this two thumbs up. Great product. Um, definitely will be repurchasing again. The only problem with this is the only place I have been able to find this is at TJ Maxx, um, which is about a 45-minute drive from where I'm at. I um, wish I could find this somewhere a lot closer. If you guys know anywhere else that I can find this product, any other stores, let me know. Um, but yeah, hope you try it. Let me know. Leave a comment below. Um, you can follow me on Instagram at strangebeautiful86. Um, and until then... See you next time. Bye.